Wario, stop making snowmen. We have a job to do. E Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's start level 3-2 right now and see what's inside. It looks to me like it's going to be a lot friendlier from the outside. Man, I hope so. That ice level was ridiculous. So we're in Jack and the Beanstalk Town. Can you climb these things? I don't think so. I don't see anything hidden behind them. Okay. And more reskin enemies. <laughs> Oh, there are these, like, some sort of wolf type of enemy of sorts. Yeah, what's up here? I must find how to get up there. Must. Somehow. I don't know how. <laughs> Am I supposed to, like, jump from somewhere else? I don't know. Maybe on top of that tree or something. What is this? Uh, oh. I see. It's a spinny flower thingy. I need a... Yeah, these are, like, wolves. Come on, give me. And... Spin. Whenever you see one of these things, you clearly can jump onto the higher platform by yourself, so it's like, why even bother trying? <laughs> yeah, that is just like Jack and the Beanstalk. <laughs> and I assume that, yes, this does lead over here. Or is this a climbing level? That would be pretty interesting if it is. Um... Now, okay, I'll see what he means later, I suppose. There's a switch. There is an invisible wall that you can't really tell. Looks like it just bends into the background. Okay, that's all that's up here, apparently. So, wait, wait. Do I want to go to the right, or is there no way to go to the right? Oh, it really is a climbing level. This will be pretty fun. <laughs> so, gotta get another one of these critters. And I shouldn't have jumped off from the top of there. I just didn't know that there wasn't more to the right side. That's okay. Just gotta climb back up. And now let's go. See what awaits us. Wait, actually, aren't I looking for a yellow switch? Ugh. It does go over to the right more. Hmm, interesting. Okay, maybe there's like multiple pathways through this place. I really hope not. <laughs> anyway, trapdoor. It's another one of these climber thingies. I don't know exactly how high I'm supposed to, you know, how high I'm expected to go here. I should say, how high I need to go, pardon me. And I probably blasted the wrong stack because I can't do it without blasting one of the other stacks. Curses! Uh, well, let's try this stack instead to get up. Hmm. Oh, come on, you're telling me that was not a hit on the block? <laughs> Looks like I can, I can just, like, bring it down, maybe. Unless there is, a, a, like, a reason to get up there. Oh, okay, that crate. Eh, with the trap spriteling. Hopefully there isn't any, uh... Um... Like, heart fragments in here. I'm gonna assume there isn't. Just because there always seems to be two collectible things at max. Because I really don't feel like blasting all those blocks, but I might just regret it. <laughs> anyway, so let's climb ourselves back up and explore the beanstalk more, apparently. <laughs> um, still looking for a gold switch. I'm going to grab this just in case. It's probably going to be some sort of ambush. Hello? You, you're new. Ow. So, what? What? what I can't... Oh, you're only affected by ground pounds. Okay. Good to know. <laughs> well, is it really just the switches over here? I could have just hit that switch and left. Really? Fine, be that way. Still mystified as to where ye ol' yellow switches, and I can't see what's back here at all. Please tell me I'm not going to miss anything if I just skip by the spot. <laughs> that would be bad game design if I would. Alright, I'm just going to imitation pterodactyls. Or chickens. Pick your poison, I suppose. Um, oh, this must be the things that uh, they were talking about, that the sprite was talking about, that you need to grab onto... Wait, can I, like, throw something? Hmm. Hmm. How about picking... No, I can't... 
Uh, am I supposed to, like, throw it at the like, eyeball? Probably. But how do I manage to tip these things over? <laughs> I mean, I'm supposed to, like, suck them or something like that to get them to roll over and so I can throw it at the whatever plant eyeball thingy it is. Yeah, that, yeah, that doesn't work. But I am able to pick them up when they're not the other way, uh, apparently. <laughs> can I like, just go... No, I can't go around you. I figured I couldn't, but well, I thought, why not? Wait, how about if I ground pound? Ah, the ground pound works. Okay, so hit that. And do a little ground pound. It's a little ground pound. Pick it up on the side and, and throw it at the thing when it's open, apparently. Can I pick it up from here? That thing keeps closing on me. You are not being very helpful. <laughs> and I am playing terrible. But what else is new? <laughs> eh. So if I... Open it up and, th and throw it at the open. Dang it! This one is very awkward. Not all that hard to figure out though, I suppose. Eh. Oh, maybe I'm just supposed to throw it from ground level. That would certainly make a lot more sense. Ah, ground level, very helpful. And it only takes one hit. I've been wasting all that time for one hit. I could use a garlic man now. Wait, wait. Did I just get myself stuck in the... F yeah, the flower patch. I guess if you don't hit one of those enemies, you get stuck. Because you get smashed into the ground. Still looking for a gold switch. <laughs> I don't think I hit the gold switch. But, let's move this across. Blue globe. I'm gonna jump down here just because I, I can tell there's something down here that I'll miss otherwise. Garlic! Thank you. Enemies. Not all that good. I can jump over that to get to go back. And there's the switch. I knew I didn't miss it. Now I have to go all the way back to the beginning. <laughs> First, the trapdoor. Better grab that. Yeah, it's one of these kinds of obstacle courses. I don't... Mm, please tell me this is gonna work. Okay. Then I go over to this side, right? Right? Yes. Now on top... Delightful! Oh, jeez, I almost fell before I got the red crystal out. It really sucked. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Wait, 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 what was that? Oh, it's just a flower guy. Okay. I thought that was... Some sort of switch over there. Alright, so here's this treasure chest now. So I remember I hit that switch. And then over here is the yellow one. Voila! Now I need you to use. No, wait, wait, I can't use you just yet. I need to do that. Now let me pick you up. Yeah! I got you before you recover. How do you like them apples? I hope I don't have to do this often. <laughs> I don't think I miss anything on those lower routes now, so... Yeah, that that was clearly designed with backtracking in mind because of the fact that you had to hit two switches on an upper level and then go back to the lower level if you wanted to get them. So I don't really feel all that bad for doing so. Oh! That worked, somehow! <laughs> um... So there isn't any real reason to do that, except for to get across easier using ye old glue globe. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> but you can bounce right on the flower. That's pretty nice. Right. What? <laughs> oh, okay, I see. Yeah. Hmm, wait, wait, wait. What's the point of these then? Am I supposed to like put it on... Oh, you can use these thingies to hit the switch. Very clever, Johnson. But not clever enough. Alright, let's move on. <laughs> uh, do I... Yeah, that's that's the, the place with the go yellow switch thingy over there. Alright, this time I'm going to do it properly. Voila, garlic man! Give me some nutrients! You're probably cheaper than just game over and... Well, okay, maybe you're not. Because that's gonna be 200. <laughs> and that's how much it costed me to continue before. But then again, this is a later level, so... 
Uh, I need a enemy to get inside the trap door. Voila! I hope I don't get anything for killing enemies. I'm just avoiding the onslaught of them lately. Oh, oh, uh, huh? Oh, dear. <laughs> oh! Okay, there's probably something more. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, dear. Aim for the coins. Okay, I should be good. No! Oh, I missed the heart fragment. How did I manage to miss it when I was getting the coins on the way down? It doesn't make any sense to me. Now I, now I can't get inside the trap door. I'm going to stun you because you're really annoying. <laughs> Can I just like jump down to that platform from the very top? I probably shouldn't. <laughs> it doesn't seem very safe. I might as well get some pocket change as long as I'm here. Alright, let's try this again. No missing heart fragment. Yeah! Alright, now we can move on. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. It's so stupid. Oh, uh, and I see a heart fragment just underneath the platform. Wow, these guys are getting aggressive. <laughs> I guess maybe they aren't reskins if they're that aggressive. Okay, I got the heart fragment. I heard the da -da 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 chime. And auto spin for the win. Get down here. Wait, what the heck are you? You just blow me around? Really? That's all you do? Come on, you can do better than that. <laughs> I have faith that you can do better than that, but I can't hit you otherwise if, unless you come to the ground, so I guess that is pretty a, a pretty decent defense. <laughs> but there's no offense. And I, I'm really want that treasure chest, but alas, I must do the battle arena. Yes, uh, those wind guys, they don't seem to come to the ground, so it's like you're going to have to knock them down. Oh, one punch does them in. Or just knocks them to the ground, apparently. Oh, it actually does do them in with just one punch. I was overdoing it before. <laughs> and it's really easy to chain combo these guys. Just bounce on them and hit the R button. Pocket change! Woo! Alright, anything... Around the edges that I'm gonna miss. Hopefully not. Let's just move on. I just noticed that that was a path that I can't return from. But I don't think I missed anything on those other paths, so I guess it's just no big deal. But it's, it's, it's another one of those things of I'm a little worried that I did miss something like that freaking ice level. What is this panel? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go down here. Because there's definitely something here. Hmm. I hope I can get back up there. I think I'll be able to get back up there, but first, get in the trapdoor. That that bounce that you get when you're slamming larger items into the trapdoor is kind of awkward at times. Okay, how do I... Oh, I bet you these are all moving platforms. Hmm. What did that other switch do? This one. Oh, it was that to stop the third one. The third one was, was apparently moving already. Okay, so I guess I gotta get the second one to cooperate with me. I think they're gonna cross over fine. Yeah, that'll be okay. Okay. This is a think-ahead type of puzzle dealio thing. And just jump across. Although these are timed differently, so... It might not matter how I set those switches up anyway. Because, you know, if you just stand on one that has a shorter uh, distance than another one, you know, traveling distance, they'll eventually meet up at one point if you just wait around. Monster magnet, or monstrous magnets. Well, surely they attract things, so I don't know. I guess we shall soon see what the critters are. That pop plops me out of here. How do you get out of here normally? Just like that, I guess, okay. Um, just want to look around to be sure. Like, is there any way to get onto that other ledge from up here? Oh, there's a purple switch. Good thing I looked over there. I remember that. There's probably a path around a higher area, I think. Unless it has to do something with this panel. 
Oh, I bet you the magnets, whatever enemies have magnets can do that. Oh, oh, oh I see the shadow of a magnet. Holy poop! <laughs> it can shoot! I've never seen a magnet that could shoot before. And that means I could use... Oh, what? Did I just grab onto this ledge instead of the magnet? Whatever. <laughs> oh, I wanted to kill it on there just for the fun of it. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try that again just for the fun of it to see. Cause I, I'm wait actually first can I grab onto that ledge? No, I didn't think so. So why was I able to? Maybe it just looked like I grabbed onto the ledge, but it, I was actually grabbing onto the mag magnet instead. Eh. I wanted to sh them to shoot their lasers, so I don't so they don't get in my way. And let's try that again. I'm gonna throw that up there. Do you grab onto the metal thing now? No, you don't. Oh, he can grab onto that, so... Huh. Wait. So he's not grabbing onto the ledge, it's the metal thing. Ah, you don't need the magnets, okay. <laughs> I wasn't wrong about that, that's weird. Guess they should have made that ledge a little bit higher, or not made those platforms, you know, grabbable. There's something down there, there's something down there, but I don't know if I should go up or down, probably up first. Because of the fact that it'll be hard to get... <gasps> that is a mean place for a switch! That is a mean place! <laughs> oh wait, I betcha that leads to... Um... That vine that takes you back up to this path. But I want to make sure that I don't miss anything up here before... Okay, that, that is a no return path. So I'm gonna have to do... Uh, uh, uh. I got it! Yeah! I, I would have hated to go back through the, all that all over again. Alright, what does this take me to? There's that. Oh, this is back at the beginning. So that was really just to go out of your way to hit that switch. And what is this? Do I want to hit that? That looks like it's going to put me in a place that I can't get back from as well. Unless those... Oh, I climb out from that well. Or at least that's what I'm trusting. Ugh. Uh, okay... Please tell me I can get out of here later and I'm not getting myself stuck in a place that I'll have to redo the level from the beginning via those balloons. Uh, this reminds me of a puzzle I used to have, or, or I'm... No, wait, actually... I'm thinking of the Rubik's Snake again. <laughs> the Rubik's Twist, actually. So I do have that, but I, I have another puzzle similar to... A, a structure like this. I don't remember where it is though. I don't remember the name of it either. But how the heck do I get across this thing? <laughs> Does this thing like have good gravity or, or something like that? I need to get on top of a spot. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna reset the position of this thing because I feel like that I'm. I had an opportunity earlier to get onto it, like right here, but I didn't because I was trying to think of how I'm supposed to get across it. Um, uh, okay, I hear a uh, sprightling going woo woo somewhere. I don't know where. Huh, right there. Is that all that's here? I'm gonna trust that's all that's here. Uh, obviously. <laughs> Thank you, Navi, for those kind words of encouragement. Let's get out of here. Oh. Need to do one of these things again. Yeah, the enemies are definitely getting a lot more aggressive than they used to be, or at least they feel like they are. So maybe they aren't reskins after all, but they, they're defeated the... Are you serious? But they're defeated the same way. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh yeah! Working those arms out. Oh, and that's switch. <gasps> and a heart fragment. And how high does this go? Goes to the ceiling, right? Yeah, there's nothing I can do about that. Now I'm gonna have to do the rigmarole back to the other area with the magnets. Shouldn't be too hard to get back up there, because I can just bypass a couple of things. Except for the magnet walls, of course. Phew. Gimme. I need the powers of your invisible stickiness. Like, okay, it's not sticky, but <laughs> it's a, it's an attraction. 
Okay, that's... To, oh, that is to get back up here, so like, there is a way to get back from there, unlike that ice level. Duh! Sorry. <laughs> oh! Oh, there's something down there. <laughs> or at least I'll be able to show off this area. I knew it was going to happen eventually. I didn't bother to jump down anything because I knew it would happen. Although, wait, was there actually anything that I could jump down? I don't... I don't recall there being anything actually come to think of it. Well, there's the thing. The springboard. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, actually it doesn't hurt, but it does take away my pocket change. Yes, I know the spring is there, but I just want to make sure I clear out the area for the sake of making sure that there isn't anything in here. Okay. <laughs> As usual, there's nothing in there, and that was just a big waste of time. So I'll just find the spring and get out of there. Alright, so what I want to do is... Grab onto the... Not the legs, the glue globes! They're, they're kind of awkward to jump down to, actually. Because you kind of grab onto other things as you go. But I guess, well, maybe they're not that bad. I'm making a mountain out of a molehill. Wait, 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 is there any... Can I pan... Can pan it vertically compared to other levels, but I don't. I don't think there's anything else. <laughs> Is this slippery? It's well, it's muddy, so it's probably slippery. Eh. Oh! Ah! <laughs> I could have used that. Ah! Well, I'll be back down there later, I suppose. I could probably even jump down there if I wanted to. Mm -hmm. I think it's those explosions that startle those critters from attacking you. Alright. So what do we have on the upper path? Nothing, really? Oh, well, okay. I can live with that, I suppose. Ah! Did it again. Freaking rams. <laughs> well, they're actually more like goats than rams, but you get what I mean. They do ram you, so I'm not too far off from that notion. Yeah, that the explosions do, do seem to be the thing that startles them from from attacking you. Because if I if I stay consistent, I notice that they stay away from you because they're like, no, I don't want to come any closer because of something that startled me. Whoa. Okay, now stop knocking me off the edge. Ah! <laughs> Wait, well, I'm gonna have to come back here for two treasures. That's not gonna be pleasant. Yeah. Garlic man. Uh, I know there's that bridge down there. Oh, there's just a nice handy ledge. Alright. That's collected. And we're out of here. I just need to find two other switches. You again! At least I know how to defeat you this time. <laughs> Flip. Grab. And voila. Oh, you take more hits, really? You're gonna be that way? <laughs> uh, how could you be that way? I thought we were buddies. I thought we were best pals. Apparently not. Our relationship meant nothing to you. <sighs> I will drown my sorrows by feasting on garlic until my health is full. You are getting expensive. <laughs> oh, that looks like another battle arena coming up a little bit later. But for now, we're going here, I guess. Still looking for two switches. I guess you can go back using the uh, um, magnets on the left side. Oh, look at the position of that blue switch. They, they literally want you to go into that underground sewer area. That is so mean. Oh, battle arena time! Can I, like, slam you guys all at once? No, really? Just gonna have to punch you individually. Alright, revenge on you guys. Sort of. You aren't as small as the other ones. Well, I, I shouldn't treat you guys the exact same way. I mean, you guys are all different, you know. You gotta treat everyone as an individual. And you individuals are pretty mean. <laughs> going to swing and hopefully kill off 
these imitation triceratopses. Is that a... Is that the plural of Triceratops? Probably not. I think Triceratops is the plural of Triceratops, if you ask me. It's like deer and deer. The way I sound I mean the way I said it the first time, it sounded grammatically incorrect. That's why I think that is the plural. Uh, but I am getting getting very off track, but that isn't you know too far back, you know the stuff that I usually make in my videos. And I will reap the spoils and hopefully be able to come back here. <laughs> no! Oh, I thought I got trapped outside somehow. <laughs> it looked like it by the by the angle of the uh, globe that's around me. And this is a lot tighter uh, for a battle arena than the other ones were. Oh, I missed. That makes me sad. Woo! It's the homing one. Well, the homing bullet one. Shoot it out in one direction, and then they, and then three split off to hit you. Uh, I think the they actually, I mean, the bullets actually block your shots. That's interesting. I didn't notice that before. Maybe when I thought I was gonna about to hit it before and didn't, that was the reason why. But man, I don't like that blue switch. I I could probably throw an enemy at it. That's probably the the way to do it. Is there a way back up to here? Please tell me there's a... Okay, there's a way to get back up here. So, all I just need is an enemy first for that switch. And then another one to get inside that trap door. E no! I bounced off the treasure chest! No, 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 no! No! How many times am I going to visit the sewer area anyway in this playthrough. <laughs> I know they're all different, but I mean, I just keep accidentally getting thrown down here nowadays. <laughs> you put me back over here? How could you do this to me? How could you do it? No! Well, I guess it's not that far to get back up there! Oh my god, I'm glad Wario had sticky fingers for once. These glue globes are kind of awkward to grab onto because of the way that he... I mean, they're away from the wall, so they aren't like your typical ones where you have to, like, push yourself against the wall to aim yourself. You actually have to aim yourself in a 3D space. Oh, and yes, I still am looking for the teal switch. Whoa! So, I'm not going back to get those two treasure chests back on uh, Goat Hill just yet because of the fact that I'm going to have to, you know, go back there twice then if I go get the one right now. So I'll just be back there a little bit later. Wait, is this supposed to... Be... I'm supposed to use this for my jump, aren't I? Yes! That's what I thought. Alright, so it's like using those... I mean, it's like using that glue globe as a springboard sort of thing earlier. Get the timing right. Good. Um, I think all the prizes are up there, yeah, so I don't have to worry about that. Get the timing. Uh, no! you think all the time I've been playing rhythm games lately, I'd have stuff like the stone. <laughs> I probably should use that other one as a springboard, actually. You know, like this one to get to the other side. Like that. That's how you get those coins. No, no, no. What? Good. Okay, wait for it to just stop and then hit the jump button. That. Spriteling. Spider Aceus is the boss's name, apparently. Mm, thank you. You guys aren't like Navi after all. Alright, so... We're looking for yet another switch somewhere. Still. And I should have done this first. Dang it. Because I have to open up... Yeah. Curses! I need another... Goat Ram. <laughs> what, are you, what are... What are... Okay, they're like a combination of like... 60 different animals. <laughs> I have no idea what they are. They're pretty cute, though. <laughs> ah, you again. Well, at least I don't have to battle you aiming off to the side. That's kind of annoying. 
Alright, so there's a treasure up there, which I'll be able to get by going through this route, apparently. Um, oh, I have to hit you to shake him down. Turn. Good. Let me grab. Thank you. Throw. To open. Throw. To hit. Walk into spiky thing to take a hit yourself. That is... Oh, it has a face! Wow! <laughs> I was about to say, that is the key components of video gaming. Wow, you spew out a lot of these things. <laughs> eh. You are quite the breeder, I have to say. I could use another garlic man. Wait, what? what's up here? Eh. I guess we'll soon find out. Is this a way back or is this another path? Oh, wow. Uh, well, I definitely want to go to the right first to get that treasure chest, so that's what I'm going to do. Maybe there's a switch off to the side as well. You know, the blue one I'm looking for. Game Boy Advance! Yeah! Wait, I don't need you to go in there. I can just do that. <laughs> and... Whoa! <laughs> Did not expect that. <laughs> Well, apparently to get on top of that, you need to jump on top of one of those blocks and not get yourself squished to oblivion. What? Ooh! Are those blocks one hit kill? I don't want to find out, to be honest. Let's just get out of here. I, I couldn't tell because I only had a half a heart there, so I would have died no matter if they just damaged me normally or not. So it's like whatever. Yeah, still looking for a blue switch. At least I think. Oh, and that's the last of the treasures too. Hmm. So there's one heart fragment. Oh, and by the way, I I, uh, I, did, I didn't notice before this before. Someone pointed out to me in the com comments. See the seven of eight in the upper right corner. That indicates how many heart fragments you have in the level. Very handy to know that. Thank you. Garlic, man! I could have used you earlier! Duh! And I forgot to check how much it was for continue, anyway. I missed a blue switch somewhere? Did I really miss a blue switch somewhere? And a heart fragment, apparently. Unless it's around the back or something, like here. Hmm. Well... What I can do first is... Get on here, because I knew that was there. I've seen those leaves before on another pathway. Because I definitely have to go back to the Goat Hill place to get myself the treasure. I don't rem recall hitting the other colored switch, so I might very well just be going back for nothing. And I fell off here for nothing. Whoa! I really fell off there for nothing, as usual. <laughs> So here we are again, in the sewer area. It's pretty murky. Luckily, there seems to be enough light, despite, you know, this being a, a crevice of some sort within the Earth. You, you would think that there wouldn't be light. I don't understand how there is. Maybe the, the ghosts themselves are the ones that do it. I don't know. Just just trying to make logic of things here. I'm not questioning it. I'm just, just saying. Yeah, I am missing a switch somewhere. And probably where the other heart fragment is. Hmm. Well, I know there's this thing here. Maybe the switch is somewhere on a higher ledge or something? I don't know. I guess I'm gonna have to search for it, obviously. I, I mean, <laughs> there's, there's no leaving this level until I 100% it. So, I guess I'll be going through this level one more time, per se, by uh, using the balloon at the start and then just scouring everything once again as carefully as I possibly can. I suppose no other way to do it. Oh! So I, I guess I'll see you when I find something. Ah! I, I see this right at the beginning. How did I miss this flower? So that's where the final heart fragment is. So you just do this. Get yourself all the way up to the top. Well, as high as you can go. And then grab the heart fragment. So that's done. Now, I still have to find that other blue switch, which is probably between here and the place, you know, where the treasure will appear once I find that blue switch. 
because I definitely didn't see anything past at that point with the switches, so I'll be searching back here somewhere, I suppose. Oh, oh, I found the switch! I found the switch! It's down in that well area. How did I miss that flower? Clearly these things blend into the environment to the point that I completely miss them. <laughs> and boop! There we go. It's too bad that I missed that on my way through here, because that's it's pretty far out of the way. Alright, I'll see you back over by the treasure chest. And there we go. Voila! Level 100%ed. Well, except for the boss, of course. Which I will see you there right now. Alright. Let's do it to it. Whenever these things get in place. Ah, I'm getting swarmed. Don't hurt me. Let me in. Wah! Only took me about 41 minutes or so for that level. Not too bad compared to the last one, that's for sure. And especially not bad compared to the uh, Stat Circus level, because I had to keep restarting that recording. Uh, Wario, what did I tell you before? Uh, you are quite the intimidating critter. So I'm going to be punching you. Or not! <laughs> I guess that's the sticky web they were talking about. So let's get... Whoa! Shockwaves! Alright, so I need probably something to get over there. I think, maybe. We'll see. No, it doesn't seem to be... Oh! These! 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 Okay. I'll pull them in, I suppose. And I missed! Oh, I see! You gotta slam her back. Got it! And I have to use, ooh, rhythm, well not rhythm, use momentum to my advantage if at all possible. Alright, I got the gist of it. Give me some glue globes. No, not a homing attack. Just, a gl just some glue globes. Thank you. I should go on, no, no, no! I was gonna go on the middle one. There we go! Now, pick up right. Yeah! I should probably... Thank camera angle. <laughs> Screwing me up. Eh. Alright. She stays stunned enough for you not to not have any issues getting off that. It doesn't seem to make any sense to walk around in the circle. Other than to dodge that thing, but it doesn't really have much of a range, does it? <laughs> and pull me in, baby. Yeah. And I wonder if I should be taking advantage of that pocket change she spews. Probably not, but I did use up a lot of pocket change in this one for garlic and continues. Whoa! <laughs> that was a fast one. Oh, getting more aggressive, I see. Maybe it would help to go around the circle at times now. Um, yeah! Still just as easy. Run, 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 run! So sticky! Shockwaves, not so sticky, but whoa! Extremely dangerous and fast. She was a terrible shot. Those wouldn't have hit me even if I stood in place. <laughs> One more hit, and this boss is done! No! Ow. Yeah. Whoa, that... that's new. <laughs> Those things don't curve very much, do they? She is definitely getting a lot more aggressive. It's not helping her, though. <laughs> and that's it! 100%! Wooah! And that's all I'm going to be doing for this part. I'll save the boss for the next part. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you then. I'll, I'll, I'll show a little cutscene when he gets an extra heart.
Can I jump in the lava? I'm gonna try that really quick. <laughs> yes, I will save, and then I will jump in the lava just as an experiment to see if ooh, to see if it will do something. These leaves are kind of finicky. Mm. Nope, just counts as an out of bounds area. <laughs> okay, hope you enjoyed. See you in the next part.